As the winter gets colder, it can be harder to keep up with your New Year's fitness goals. Reporter Emily Haugen spoke with a lifetime trainer who has advice to keep people going. With icy temperatures outside, finding motivation to get to the gym is tough. One thing I love about January is the hope that people have for themselves, the refresh, the restart, so I see it a lot. Lifetime fitness professional Carrie Anderson says she sees many people making big goals for the new year. A little bit more resistance. But getting too ambitious in early January could lead to a slump. Realistically, most people are striving to get to the gym consistently two to three days a week. So set your standards maybe a little bit low and surprise yourself. Maybe one week you do make it five times. You're doing wonderful. You're pushing hard. Another thing Anderson encourages is variety, but not too much. Good. She says finding some consistency is the key to seeing results. Maybe you do a mile um, on the treadmill. How long did that take you? Week one of the month, right? And next month, do that same mile and see that progress. So some kind of stability within the variety is helpful for tracking progress along the way. There we go. Once you do that, she says it's important to trust yourself. Good, just to your chin. And if you have one, your trainer. Okay, now I'm gonna challenge you a little extra. Sometimes you can do more than you'd expect. You are holding back so much untapped potential. It's crazy. There you go. Well, you definitely beat my mark at five. You're going beyond. Anderson says community can help you find that potential. You can seek that accountability, whether it's in fitness classes or just working out with someone side by side. You can show up and you see the same faces every day, every time, and you know they're gonna be there, and you know they're gonna ask if you're not. Exhale on the way up. She says with education, good. motivation, and accountability. Good, good, good. It's easier to reach your fitness goals. We can do this, yeah. yep. In Plymouth, Emily Haugen, CCX News. Anderson also says results don't come without proper nutrition. She recommends staying hydrated and watching what you eat to complement all the work you put in in the gym. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.